more white man lives. show you how we can begin to come back to who we are. Bring it out! The book of Acts chapter 3 verse 19. Oh, Repent ye therefore and be converted. What does being converted mean? Change, right? Go to uh, Psalm 197. We got to be changed, so that's, that's being converted. In order for our people to come together, we must change our mind state. Right! Because the mind state... People, they were thinking wrong the whole time, man. People don't want to admit that. Exactly. You're right. But this is what can change you. Read this. The book of uh, Psalms, chapter 19, verse 7. I read. The law of the Lord is perfect. Because a lot of people say we can't be perfect. But God said the laws of the Lord is perfect. Read. Right. The law of the Lord is perfect. Uh-huh. Converting the soul. This is what will convert our people when we can be on one accord. Because if not, we're going to keep going off into our own understanding. Give me that in um, Proverbs 3 and 5. Because our people, they want to go off what they think. They don't want to do no study. They don't want to do no research. To see, as a people, how can we come back together? Because, hey, we can be out here doing this and that as a separatist. And, hey, hey I got this. And look down on the next brother because that's how it is. When one person get rich out the black community, they look down like, hey, I'm different than these people. But you're never gonna rise above above the, the status of your people. That's right. 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 That. Trust in the Lord, the book of Proverbs, chapter 3, verse 5. Uh-huh. Trust in the Lord with all thy heart. Okay. And lean not unto thine own understanding. God say trust in the heart and in him with your with your heart. Lean not to your own understanding. That's what our people do as a whole. They want to go off what they think. But the Bible is made for us and for us and only for us. Right. That's, right. That's what we got to come back to, our true nationality. Now go back to Deuteronomy. We're going to show you some more curses. that going to show you who this Bible is talking to. Jump to 68. Go ahead and give it to me. Bring it out. The book of Deuteronomy, uh -huh. chapter 28, verse 68. Uh -huh. read. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. Okay, Egypt has a meaning. It is synonymous for bondage. Well, we're going to get you the meaning out of the Bible. Because we're not going to use our own words. Um, you said that the Bible is made for us. Yes. But back in Africa, they didn't believe in God. They didn't believe in God, but they came here and they like, you know, 
Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay.
His commandments. Uh -huh. And His commandments are not grievous. His commandments are not grievous. I'm going to teach you something. Shalom, Israel. I'm Elder Nathaniel, Israel United in Christ. YouTube likes to shut our channels down, as some of you have noticed, <laughs> ever so often. Subscribing to join IUIC will assure you will always stay connected to our YouTube accounts. We want to do our best to make sure this truth gets up. Please click and join our subscriber YouTube channel called Join IUIC to stay linked to all of our videos. So again, please make sure you subscribe to this and join IUIC channel to get your latest updates from all our YouTube channels. Shalom.